Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Court and we're gonna talk about all things Taurus today. So if you have a Taurus friend, if you are a Taurus, comment below, let me know if I'm onto something with this, if I miss anything, let me know below. Mm -hmm. Let me know below and let's just get into it, shall we? Okay, hey everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I am Courtney and we talk about all things astrology, spirituality, life stuff here. And in this video, we're gonna talk all about Taurus. Taurus traits, Taurus things. T -t -t Taurus is what I like to say. I go, T -t -t Taurus, one of those. But so today we're gonna talk all about Taurus. So what is Taurus energy? How does it show up? What are their gifts? What are the good things? What are the things that are like a little bit harder to kind of deal with? You know, we're gonna talk about it today. Taurus season always happens from April 20th to May 20th. So in that time frame, we are being met with Taurus energy. That means the sun is in the sign of Taurus and we are being blessed with just Taurusness. So during this time, what ends up happening is we, Taurus energy tends to be a little bit slower. It's more like stop and smell the roses. It's about the simplicities of life. Taurus love their food. They love their wine. They love the things that the 3D physical world really has to give us. That includes nature, going for hikes, walks, literally stopping to smell the roses, taking in things that are like treats, like yummy, delicious, like goodies. A Taurus loves that. When Taurus is in their best element, you know, they are here to kind of be, I always see Taurus energy as sort of like mother nature. Like they're here to help heal. They're very environmentally sound. They're the ones that kind of just want those finer simplicity, simplicity, simplistic things in life. Taurus is also ruled by the planet Venus. So Venus is all about beauty, love, values, beliefs, money. Tauruses tend to be hard workers um, and kind of like, especially in the realm of money. However, there's part of this where because Taurus does like to go a little bit slower sometimes, they can kind of be more on the, I don't wanna say lazy, they're just not as like push, push, push. It's more of a slow process when they're working, when they're changing things, it tends to move at a slower pace. However, they are, they are still very good workers. Tauruses also have this, um, I guess like stereotype around them that they're very stubborn. They are ruled by the bull. So technically speaking, bull are pretty stubborn. And yes, Taurus is a fixed sign, which means fixed is stubborn. They're the energy that once they commit to something, they're loyal, they're all in. But on that same kind of wavelength, they're they're fixed. So it, it can kind of hinder them from taking steps to grow and change. And then it can also really prevent them from having people in their lives, like maybe they're super loyal to them. And then if somebody does something, eh, done. It's like that sort of stubbornness. So stubborn can go on both ways. We don't necessarily think that stubborn is completely bad. It's also just something that Tauruses really need to learn to work with. It's like, okay, where am I staying in my comfort zone of that safety, like beautiful, like, ah, oh, I just wanna be here all day and smell the roses and not doing what I need to change versus like, okay, I can see I need to change. What is the plan? How can I do this in a way that feels good to me? And stop and smell the roses on the way there. Taurus is also, I think one of the things that makes them really cool is that they're ruled by Venus is that this, they love the finer things like beauty in life. So, you know, obviously that looks different for everyone, but maybe that means they're going to get their nails done. Maybe it's like pampering themselves. Maybe it's going to, um, you know, just having like a plethora of food available for people to come over. It's really like getting that nice bottle of wine and that's sort of what they would work hard for is to have those type of things available to them in their life. 
So Taurus season is a time where obviously we get met with this great energy and in the Northern hemisphere, it happens as we're moving into spring. So things are budding, things are boom, blooming for us. And that is very Taurus like energy. We kind of get this pause. We come from airy season, which is fast. I have this idea. I want to go into the next thing. And then Taurus comes around and is like, uh, -uh slow down a minute. Let me take, catch it, catch my breath. Let me take in all this new growth that has been happening. Let me see my people. Let me just take a minute. It's like a pause filled with snacks, filled with naps, filled with this just like slow pace. And it's great until it's time to change. So that is the thing that Tauruses have to work on the most is actually being okay with changing things. Nothing ever stays the same because they are a fixed earth sign. This means that they cement into their, their ideas. They cement into friendships. They cement into relationships. Everything is solid for them. And if it's not solid, then that feels a little uncomfortable for them and it can make things really hard to adapt to change. So let's talk about a few celebrities that are um, Tauruses, just so we can all like get the gist of what this energy kind of is. All right, so let's talk about some famous people. Are we ready for this? Well, Miranda Kerr, John Cena is a Taurus, people. I mean, he's a wrestler. Taurus is, a, that's another thing too. Taurus is all about this like, like touch. When I think of Taurus, I literally think of all the senses. So they're like touch, feel, smell, um, taste. What are all the senses? I'm losing it at the moment, but all those senses, it's like actually touch and tangible. That is Taurus energy. John Cena, the guy's a beast, man. He is very Taurus-like. Lizzo is also a Taurus, which is very interesting because she worked really, really hard to get to where she is. You can see that. And her persistence, stubbornness really got her on that road to getting, she didn't give up. She kept going. And also another thing, which is interesting because Taurus being about the body, being kind of about like that more like touchy, like tangible side of the energy. She is very like body positivity and that actually resonates like very deeply with the Taurus energy. Mm. Okay, so this is another one. The Rock is a Taurus, which is so funny because that stability solid guy who's very, like when you see him, he's very like, just grounded in there, right? He's big guy. And it's funny just to have Taurus as that kind of like archetype, but th there is a softness to him. There is a beauty to him that is also very Tor Tor Taurus-like. Okay, David Beckham is also a Taurus. Very interesting. So obviously these people are celebrities, but I really encourage you to go and look and see like what are your Taurus friends, the people that you, you know, you hang out with who are Tauruses. There's something about them that is often very, um, they just appear to like those nicer things in life. So, uh, you know, it's having those simplicities, having like your, your house super clean, having, um, you know, cuddling up on the couch with like a nice big bag of something like, like there's something about it. Right. So we've got, these are the celebrities, the rock Dwayne Johnson. We've got David Beckham. We have Lizzo. We have Channing Tatum. I mean, magic Mike tours video. Am I right? And John Cena. I just said all guys pretty much except Lizzo, but I mean, that gives us a really good rundown of kind of some of the people who are Taurus energy and what this energy is about. So if you are a Taurus, comment below, let me know. And what is the most favorite thing about you and your sign? Did I miss something? Let me know and I will see you guys in my next video. Oh, if you wanna book a reading with me, I always have those available. I do astrological readings. So comment below if you want one or check the description bar. I will leave the links there and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.